Hi guys, so these are my cacao and nut butter flapjacks, really tasty, super quick to make, um, great for snacks, uh, has lots of good ingredients in it, so it's uh, quite healthy for you. All you need is some coconut oil and some nut butter with a hazelnut, cashew nut, peanut butter would be fine. Um, add in some maple syrup or honey if you don't have maple syrup and then pop that on the hob to melt gently while you prepare the rest of the ingredients and um, so I've used gluten-free oats but you can use um, normal rolled oats which is fine so to that you add in your um, cocoa powder so I use a really good quality dark cocoa powder that tastes so like intense and it really we really taste it in the flapjack so I use a couple of tablespoons of that to mix into my oats so it does take quite a lot of uh, cacao uh, cocoa powder to mix up into the oats but you want it to be like super like chocolatey so it's really tasty so to that I also add some seeds so I've got a mixture of sunflowers uh, pumpkin seeds flax seeds so I just chuck in like a couple of uh, tablespoons of that really good for you so um, especially for kids as well they won't even know that they're eating all those seeds so it's a good disguise so I pour in everything that I've melted so all my nut butter is melted in with my maple syrup and the coconut oil in there as well which really gives it a nice coconutty flavour um, that kind of binds everything together and it's um, really healthy for you so just mix it all in together so everything becomes really glossy and then with that I will just pat it all down so just pat it all down into um, you can pour it into another baking dish or I've just used the same one here that I've uh, mixed it in less washing up so uh, all mix everything in together and then pat it all down and then you bake it in the oven so it doesn't take that long to bake so I would say about 15 minutes or so 10 to 15 minutes or so until it's all kind of come together and uh, what you want to do is when you take it out is you let it cool before you cut it so it won't break up so let it cool and it's great recipe for granola as well I hope you guys enjoy